in today's video i am going to show you a step by step guide on how to calculate the cutting length of a four legged stirrup for a column if you are excited to learn a practical skill that's essential for construction make sure to stick around until the end we will be working with a column that has a width of 400 mm and a depth of 600 mm the main bars have a diameter of 20 mm and the stirrups are 8 mm in diameter with a clear cover of 40 mm by the end of this lecture you will be able to confidently calculate the cutting length of the stirrups for this scenario but before we jump into the calculations let's establish the basics in four legged stirrups the cutting length of stirrup 1 and stirrup 2 are the same so we will find out the cutting length of a single stirrup the formula to calculate the cutting length is given by l equal to twice a plus b plus hook length minus 90 degree bend plus 135 degree bend to know the value of a we need to find the value of x which is the center to center spacing between the longitudinal bars along the horizontal direction the formula to calculate x is given by x equal to width of column minus twice clear cover plus twice diameter of stirrup plus twice diameter of main bar upon 2 whole divided by 3 the width of column is 450 mm clear cover is 40 mm diameter of stirrups is 8 mm and the diameter of main bars is 20 mm on substituting these values the value of x will be 111.33 mm with the value of x obtained we can calculate the dimension a a is calculated by using the formula a equal to twice x plus twice half the diameter of main bars plus twice half the diameter of stirrup on substituting these values the value of a will be calculated as 250.66 mm now let's calculate b which is given by the formula column depth minus twice clear cover plus twice half the diameter of stirrup the depth of column is given as 600 mm clear cover is 40 mm and the diameter of stirrup is 8 mm on substituting these values B will be equal to 512 mm. Now let's finalize the cutting length calculation. The ultimate calculation of the cutting length L for stirrup 2 is composed of various components. L is given by twice A plus B plus hook length minus 90 degree bend plus 135 degree bend. Substituting the values of A, B, the provided hook length and bend angles, L will be equal to 1589.32 mm. it shall be noted that in the above equation we have considered a length of 10 times the diameter for the hook that's 10d we have subtracted 2 times the diameter for each of the 390 degree bends that's 2d and 3 times the diameter for each of the 2 135 degree bends as indicated in the drawing thus the cutting length of both stirrup 1 and stirrup 2 in this four legged stirrup arrangement is 1589.32 mm I hope you found this video helpful. If you want to learn how the bar bending schedule of a project is done, then I am giving you an opportunity to learn all these things in a single combo course by the name Advanced Quantity Surveying and Bar Bending Schedule. This course covers everything from excavation and PCC to footings, columns, beams, brickwork and more. Each and everything will be covered both manually and through excel sheets. plus you will learn how to prepare the bar bending schedules for footings beams columns slabs and more the link of the course you will find in the description box of this video thank you